How's it going, my wrestling heroes? Wanted to show you some stuff that has been popping up. Um, at the end of the video, though, I just want to give you a safe warning. I got some pretty bad news towards the end. So if you want to miss the sappy stuff, yeah, just, uh, I don't know, go watch my previous video. <laughs> it's actually, it's in correlation to the video that we just showed from earlier today. But this right here, uh, my friend Tommy Slab, which is the same guy that had that Enzo uh, Amore exclusive fan pack. Um, he just got his hands on the modern day Maharaja. This is the actual image. This is the actual figure that we're going to be getting exclusively in the smackdown playset it is available at ringside discount code hero will save you 10 percent at checkout seeing this an actual person seeing this in like out of the box in its entirety i actually i'm liking this i i'm enjoying this a lot underneath the um he didn't send me pictures of with the uh, the thing off the headdress piece um but like the scan right there i see it of course it, it's not going to be the afro so if you are wondering if you're getting like that full afro style that he's got going on it's not there um i'm pretty sure my guy i'm gonna yeah i'm gonna have to hit up bew for that man he's actually working on one right now on some current but the attire right there it is the gray attire it looks like you got the flowers so really awesome uh figure and I, I don't think it comes with the wwe title i could be wrong from what i recall i believe it was just a figure itself again this is part of the exclusive smackdown ring really awesome dude i cannot wait to get my hands on this um next up he also did find the what is it the aj styles the fan pack it's um it's very similar to the Enzo, except with AJ Styles, instead of the chain and necklace, you are getting those gloves, those AJ Styles gloves. So when you put them together, it does do the P1 logo. It's a basic, it's it's kind of, this is what it is. It's a basic inside and elite packaging. And with, of course, with other extras. Um, next thing that I wanted to show you guys, the muscle, uh, these little tiny figures that are kind of like retro. They used to have something like this in the past. These are going to be available at SDCC, San Diego Comic Con so come july um i don't know if they'll be exclusive to sdcc but these ones should be popping up here the figures that are actually included with this i know it's kind of hard to see because they're all bunched up but i do have the loose images on this it's um mean gene oakland up here in the corner roddy roddy piper the iron chic rick flair andre the giant and the macho man there's also a few more we got uh it looks, I can't tell who, someone drop it in the comment section. Uh, I believe that's Hacksaw Jim Duggan right there on the corner. We have the Sarge, Ted DiBiase, Jake the Snake Roberts, Ultimate Warrior, and it looks like Junkyard Dog. So again, these ones more, will most likely be exclusive to SDCC. More information will come in once that comes in next month. And again, if you're not familiar with San Diego Comic Con, they show all the new up and coming figures. Um, also, if you guys remember, I think it was probably about three weeks ago to a month. These ones right here, um, they have shown mock images as well as loose. These actually have been found. They're finally hitting retail. They're hitting uh these are exclusive to target and i actually do uh fig click thanks a lot man um he did send the upc which is the barcode number it's right there do a quick screenshot if you do want to get your hands on this now just a fair warning this dpci most likely will link to the previous uh wwe hall of champions so just wanted to give you a heads up on that so just make sure you ask that it's the right figure again these are the same ones that come with the revival um here's the bad news you guys uh, oh man this is terrible so if you guys remember our previous video that we just did this it was on the closing of toys for us it looks like gamestop is falling in that same uh scenario they they're trying to find a buyout right now um and the whole thing behind it uh to my understanding it's online retail like amazon like <laughs> amazon is pulling a john cena on us with the shovel man like he's they're just burying amazon they can't be stopped uh, not only that but if if you do recall i think it's been several years now a lot of the games now have been been able to be downloaded and i know you're saying hero fakes why are we talking about gamestop well just keep in mind that gamestop has gotten a lot of exclusives in the last couple of years wwe figure exclusives so you know anything like the retro fest like the Shawn michaels the macho man oh man I, it's gonna be a rough one and it's it seems like a lot not just video game stores but like toy stores like this is the direction and the path that we're going with but i just hope that you know they figure something out because again we would be missing out on a lot of wwe figure exclusives i hope you guys enjoyed the video be sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel and we'll see you on the next one